Before we get into today's video, you guys should take your privacy seriously. You guys should check out private internet access. They support gift cards, all major credit cards, Bitcoin, and PayPal. They also support iOS, Android, Linux, Windows, Mac, more. They also have 3,000 servers in over 28 countries, so you should never really have a problem with speeds. You can connect uh, five different devices. You can block ads, trackers, and malware, no traffic logs, unlimited bandwidth, and so on. It is such a nice VPN service. I'm using it. I love it. Link will be below. They got a great deal going on. So if you want to know how you can stop buffering completely on your wireless devices, you're going to need to pick up a power line adapter. Doesn't matter if it's D-Link, TP-Link, Cisco, it doesn't matter on the brand. Some of these power line adapters come with one port, two port, or three port. So basically what you do is you buy a unit. You need to buy it one set and another set because the one... One of these adapters get plugged into your, by your router or wherever. You run a cable from the back of your router. Your router should have four or eight ethernet ports. So you plug it into one of them. You take that ethernet cable and you plug the other end into the adapter. You plug the other end into the wall, somewhere in the wall. It can be on a power bar and an extension cable, but you need to be careful because some of them do cause problems and speed decreases if it's through a power cord or uh, an extension cord, okay, power bar. Now, if you have it plugged directly into the wall, you shouldn't have a problem. Take the other unit to whatever room you want that device to be powered on. Now, if you want it in your bedroom, you'd obviously plug it in your bedroom. You would run an ethernet uh, cable from that device in the bedroom, like this other adapter, to your device. So the only thing you should need is maybe a six foot, 10 foot, Ethernet cable, two Ethernet cables, one from the router to the adapter, the one adapter, and then wherever in your house you plug in the other one. Now, <coughs> there is a few things to note with these. Um, if your internet, uh, you know, connection goes down, your your modem or router messes up, you may need to unplug these and replug these in because sometimes these adapters can't pick up that there was a drop in the connection. Okay. It's very rare that this happens, but it may happen. So you just unplug one, plug it in, and it should work. If it still doesn't work and pick up that your connection is connected, unplug both of them for a second and plug them back in, and it should re-trigger. Now, with these, you actually get full speed. So they have different, you know, models. They have ones that are rated for 100 megabytes, 500 megabytes, 1 gigabyte. Uh, ports, obviously, for you guys, for your internet speed. Depending on what your speed is... The 500 should do you fine. If you ever upgraded, you're good to go. Now, <coughs> again, some of these have one or two, three uh, ports on them. There is ones with higher that I've seen, but the most known ones are one, two, three ports on these. So if you get one with two or three ports, that would allow you for that room, your living room or whatever, to connect two different devices and have them hardwired, which is a fucking plus. Because this is the surefire way to stop lagging that if you know it's your connection without having to run a 100 foot cable or 200 foot cable with an extension all the way through your house drilling holes. And if you live in an apartment and stuff like that and the walls are thick, sometimes the wireless can suck um, depending on the router, obviously. So I am going to have a router tip video how you can kind of tweak your router a little better. But however... I figured I would do this little review. So if you guys are looking for something to cut down the lag and stuff like that, power liner adapters are the best method to go. I picked up this pair right here that is D-Link, uh, the 500 megabytes. I think it was like 40 bucks when I picked these up. So you can get them anywhere. Again, I can't name the stores because I don't know where you live. Just look around, see what you can get. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Peace out made it to the end of the video thank you for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe don't forget on the left is a video in main lake and on the right you can check out my last video again thank you for checking out the video it means a lot see you on my next one peace